So I'm demonstrating a Kuma Japanese cruiser at the moment. It's interesting how the guns are laid out. It's like the Clemson American cruiser level 4. Uh, I think it was level 4 from memory. Uh, where it's got uh, two lots of torpedo tubes on each side of the sh ship. And this is an ocean open map. So I sort of like hiding behind stuff myself, but you no, know, you do what you got to do. map gets a bit boring too when it's got no islands or anything there but it's a different way of doing business so the idea here is I'm advancing and then I'm going sideways to let off some torpedoes before I see any enemy planes or ships or whatever there's no aircraft carriers but some of the battleships all cruisers even have a, like a spotter plane or two on them. And then I can be prepared to run away when I encounter the enemies. I might get two lots of torpedoes off, uh, like one when I first turn, and then you know, 20 seconds later, 30 seconds later, whatever it is, the reload time. Have a look, there's a destroyer there. Waypoint reached. Another destroyer to the right. Oh, that's heaps far away. Let's see if any enemies stumble into that. They're going around. Like in a circle to vertical. Can't reach. Our ships have all gone south nearly. Got pretty good guns on our cruisers. Five second reload time instead of battle. Of course, a lot less powerful. Die now and have some fun charging at the enemy. That's a bad shot. Problem solved, sir. Sometimes it's helpful to change your speed or you know, go from forward to reverse and then back to forward so the enemy misses. 
Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. out in front in the ocean mission. The designated target. R.I.P. 